In this interesting and challenging question, we have a square inside a triangle with one angle as 45 degree and one of the side as 4 plus 6 centimeter. Exciting part is with this limited data, we have to find area of triangle. Let's check this simple and elegant solution. We'll solve the same question in two different ways. Let's check our first approach here. For that, we'll drop a perpendicular from point A on BC. Now, area of this triangle ABC, by formula, it is half of base, that's BC, times height, which is AG. Now, here we know the length BC, that's given as 10 cm. So, basically, question is reduced down to find height AG here. For that, let's join AE first. We know that in a square, diagonal makes an angle of 45 degree with the side length. Now let's concentrate on triangle ABE. Let's draw a circle uh, passing through this vertex is AEB here. Now AE is the chord which is making an angle of 45 degree at the circumference. By converse alternate segment theorem, we know that if a chord is making an angle of 45 degree at the circumference, then at this point A, the tangent will also make an angle of 45 degree with the chord. So basically we can say here that AC length, that's the tangent to this red circle. Now here CA is the tangent and CB, that's a secant. So applying tangent secant theorem, we will get CA square, that's tangent square is CB times of CE. Now here CB length that's 6 plus 4 or 10 centimeter. CE length that's 6 centimeter. So CA square is 60 centimeter square. We'll use this result later on. Now let's check the triangle AGC. Now in this triangle applying Pythagoras theorem we'll get AG square plus GC square that's hypotenuse square or AC square. Now AG if we'll check the triangle ABG, it's an isosceles right angle triangle. This angle here will also be 45 degree. And thus AG is same as BG length. So this will be BG square and GC. So GC length, if we'll see, GC is nothing but full length, that's 10 centimeter minus BG. So GC will can replace by 10 minus BG. And AC, AC same as CA and AC square will be 60. Now opening the bracket and simplifying it, we'll get a quadratic in terms of BG. Solving this quadratic, we'll get two values. Ignoring the negative value, we'll get BG length as 5 minus root 5 centimeter. But in this triangle ABG, we know that BG and AG are equal. And thus AG is, on simplifying it, we'll get as 2.764 centimeter. Now, as we have got the height here, so putting these values here, BC as 10 and AG as 2.764. Simplifying it, we'll get our area of triangle ABC as 13.82 centimeter square. And that's our answer. Now, let's check the second approach. Let's check the solution. Let's start by assuming the side length of square as A centimeter and this length FC is B centimeter. Let's draw the diagonal of the square AE. We know diagonal bisects the angle and thus this angle here will be 45 degrees. Now, if you look at the triangle ABC, this bigger triangle and triangle AEC, this smaller triangle. In both the triangles, we have got 45 degree angle and angle alpha is common. So by angle angle similarity, these two triangles are similar to each other. As the triangles are similar, so thus the ratio of corresponding sides will be equal. So if we'll take AC upon BC, that will be equal to EC upon AC. Now here putting the values, BC is your full length that is 4 plus 6 or 10 centimeter and EC, EC is 6 centimeter. How about AC? AC is A plus B. So putting these values here, now cross multiplying it, we'll get A plus B whole square is 60 or a plus b is square root of 
60 centimeter now here if we look at this angle f this angle is 90 degrees so in triangle efc applying pythagoras theorem we'll get a square plus b square is 6 square now this value of b we can put from here so b is square root 60 minus a so we'll put value of this b here so we'll get our equation as a square plus root 60 minus a square is 36 now opening up this bracket so we'll get our equation in this form let's divide full equation by 2 so we'll get this quadratic equation now solving this quadratic by using quadratic formula we'll get value of a as this simplifying it we'll get a as square root of 15 plus minus root 3 now let's arrange these figures so what we have got till now is a plus b is root 60 and a is root 15 plus minus root 3 so from here a can be either root 15 minus root 3 or root 15 plus root 3 putting values of this a in this equation we will get value of b as root 15 plus root 3 and for this value of a corresponding value of b will be root 15 minus root 3 now which of the value is valid so let's have a look here again so if we'll check this angle b is 45 angle a is 90 plus some angle so we are sure here angle alpha that's less than 45 degree here angle f is 90 and thus angle e angle e will be more than 45 degrees so what we are getting here is in triangle efc angle e is greater than angle c and thus the side opposite will be greater so we can say here safely that side b will be greater than a and b is greater than a thus this first value of a and b is valid and let's remove this second value here now let's check the area of triangle AEC and we know area is nothing but base into height so half of base into height here base is AC and angle F is 90 degree thus height is EF so area of this triangle AEC will be half of A plus B is root 60 so it will be half of root 60 times A and A is root 15 minus root 3 simplifying it we'll get area of triangle aec as 15 minus 3 root 5 centimeter square but we have to find area of this bigger triangle and we know that this triangle abc and aec these are similar triangles and we know when two triangles are similar then ratio of their area is square of ratio of their sides now here area of eac this we have calculated earlier so we are replacing it here how about BC so BC length is 10 centimeter AC AC length is a plus B or root 60 so let's replace BC by 10 and AC by root 60 now simplifying it we'll get area of triangle ABC as 25 minus 5 root 5 centimeter square simplifying it it is 13.82 centimeter square and that's our answer I hope you enjoyed the solution I will see you in next video Till then, tata, bye bye.